Not bad. That doesn't make a whole lot of sense when you really think about it, but I'm not going to question it because reasons. Anyway, let's go pick up a present over here, which I assume is over here, and I hope it's over here. Over here, over here, over here. Over there! I do not see anything. God damn it. Boy. Well, I guess this is just a waste of my time, too. Guess what that means? Tacky fast-forwarding time! Hey, I'm getting paid by the minute here. I'm just kidding. I'm not getting paid at all. Oh, God, that dinosaur's coming at me pissing. Oh, my God. Anyway, we have another wet sore. Wet nose sore. That's, that's funny. So we just bash. Um, we can freeze. I assume that'll work. Jeff, you shoot. Who you can use Thunder Beta for some reason. We miss. Great poo. Great. I don't blame you. Freeze Omega. Oh, there you go. Foot. How on earth? Oh, well, I guess that kind of does. It's scaring yes. Makes sense. Good job, Jeff. Still the powerhouse you are. Yep, Pooh's now level 56. Awesome. Oh my god. So much. And two vitality? Holy shit. Damn, Pooh, you are broken. What's your defense looking like right now, by the way, Pooh? Even without, like, all your items being able to be equipped. Uh, actually, you know, I could have checked and equipped. 153. That is not bad. Paul is still, like, tanking everybody in terms of defense. Which, honestly, should not be the case, but... Whatever. It's whoever you give items. Anyway. So, apparently to the southwest, there's the fire sanctuary, which I assume... Oh, no. It's that disgusting head thing again. Ew. Ew. Thank God we don't have to fight that thing again. It's as easy as a Freeze Omega to get rid of him, honestly. Oh, god damn it. Don't... Okay. Wait a minute, is that the present up there? No, I already got that present. Okay. Yep. Man, I literally wasted this entire episode doing absolutely nothing. But whatever, I don't really care. Is that the Brawny Man? Okay. Yeah, I'm talking about this, this show again. Oh, hey, there's Abe Lincoln. That's, that's funny. Anyway, speaking of Abe Lincoln, I'm watching Lincoln right now in uh, one of my history classes for the year. Or not year. Just for, for a period of time watching Lincoln. It's a pretty funny movie at times. I like that movie. Very good. Very good movie. Well, that's a good way to take care of the wetness sore by spamming his eye and getting his magic attack. Good deal. Oh, there's Gandhi. Hey, I'm actually getting all these references. That's pretty funny. I mean, it's pretty hard not to get these references, but whatever. How on earth do they have to stay out? Jesus. Oh, God. Whatever. Alright. So, where to go? Where to go, in fact? I'm assuming over this way. I never checked to see if there was an ATM in here. I'm assuming there isn't, but let's go see. Like, this guy back here who's hiding in the bushes... Maybe he has something? I don't know. Honestly, it looks like the dinosaurs could get in here really easily. You're born, aren't you? I'm a worldwide tender. Oh. It's known as an economic superpower. Okay. Uh, what an ass. No, that is not okay. Okay, well then. <laughs> I can't upgrade at all. I suppose we know that that means it's time to teleport out of here and go grab some stuff. Quickly, let me check. Can I teleport to here anyway? Underworld. Yes, I can. Okay. Well, then, let's do this. I will be right back with some money. See you guys in a minute. Well, then, that didn't take too long. I basically did all the swapping and trading I needed to do. And pretty much did it all off screen. Here's Ness's inventory. Not too bad. Here's Paula's, here's Jeff's, and of course, here's Pooh's. Basically, the only thing I did was give Jeff the shiny coin, give Paul the holy frying pan, and give Ness the ultimate bat and the shiny coin. I also bought a couple different items. For example, I bought the uh, Mammoth Burger simply to see if it had a funny description. Mammoth Burger. We need your... Okay, that's not even funny. 
I bought a couple horns of life, mostly for just Paula. In fact, I think I only bought one. And for... Actually, no, I, I bought another one for Jeff, too. For Pooh, I bought three bottles of DX water. And that's about it. All good. Oh, I never sold the Night Pendant. Let's do that. Actually, isn't, isn't the Night Pendant really good? Let me see. Just be equipped on your body. Absorbs the light of a flash attack. No. It can't be good. Okay. Well, might as well sell it. And there you go. Yep, definitely not as good. Alright, good deal. Bye bye, let's play again sometime. See, I decided not to go with that tent, obviously, up there. I went to uh, Onet and basically did it. I was allowed to teleport out of this place, which is cool. I tried to call Excargo Express, though, to drop off a couple things, and they simply will not come to this region. It's actually a pretty funny dialogue conversation. He's just like, hee hee, I can't get there. Haha. <laughs> oh yeah, I can't, I can't, I can't get there. Get the fuck out of here. And that's basically what he says, except he doesn't use fuck because this is an E-rated game. Good times. The hell? Okay, we are leaving there real quick. Besides, we have to go to the southwest, don't we? Oh, no. <sighs> Can I dodge it somehow? Nope, just gotta take what's coming to me? Never mind. Didn't even try. Well, there's a present over there, so I might as well go grab that. Hmm. I wonder where that cave is. Man, it's already 11 o'clock. Oi. Oh, well. I'll go to bed late again tonight. Whatever. I don't really care. There's a cloak of kings. There you are. And thus, we have all the items for Pooh I'm probably going to end up getting. Uh, that probably went to Paula's inventory. No, it went to Mrs. Huh. No way. He had an extra inventory space. Here you are, Pooey boy. Poor Poo boy. And by wearing that, his defense rises up to 173. Basically, they all give him a 20% defensive increase. That puts him up to Jeff's length. That is awesome. Now, if only I could get that sort of kings. <laughs> uh, silly me. You know what? I need to check. What do all those items do? Just really quickly. Diadema kings. Miscellaneous equipment. Increases his defense. That's all it says. Okay, how about the cloak of kings? No, apparently they all just say the same thing. Whatever, then. I figured it would tell me, like, what they prevent, but I guess none of them prevent anything. That's pretty stupid. Ah, here we go. Is that the red geyser he was talking about? Nope, that's definitely another blue geyser. Well, I don't need that. Uh, yep, I don't need it. What do we got over here? Let's see. In case of danger, evacuate here, the boss. Silly tenders. Either dinosaurs don't come and attack me, so I can relax, except now I can't get out. Ring, 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 banana phone. Boop, 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 boop. Ring, 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 banana bird. Uh, I would love a banana bird. Banana birds would probably be a cool pet. Unfortunately, they're probably not legal. Actually, you know what? I, I bet a banana bird could be pretty legal. Anyway, let's go inside this good old hole and see what we got going on in here. Let's rock. Oh, dear. Well, we got some sick-ass lava in here. And some fire enemies. All right. Yeah, kind of glad I kept on that flame pendant, just saying. <laughs> oh, dear. I really wish I should have bought a flame pendant for everyone. That would make this place so broken. I don't know if it can do that. That would literally break this place. But I think we should be fine. I mean, we're not underleveled by any means. Word. Let's just... Oh, shit. There's fire everywhere. There's also a present which I can't seem to reach. Like, literally, look at that. How on earth am I supposed to get... Oh, there's a rope. Okay. Well, let's go through this place and see if I can't get everything. And the, the, the fires were running away from me. And I got back attacked. I was just saying that last episode. Here's the Psychic Psychos attack. The Major Psychic Psycho. Ow. Ow. Fuck. Wait, I have two flame pendants? Oh, wait, no, she has a C pendant. That blocks both. So literally both Paula and Jeff are unable to really die in this area. That's just really embarrassing. Let's use LP Beta. Let's use Freeze Gamma on one of them. Jeff, you're going to use the, uh, Jeff, I don't know. How about the, the Heavy Bazooka, sure, on the Major Psycho. And Pooh, you're going to use Freeze Gamma on that guy. That should be good. Bam! Let's rock him. 
I'm guessing their psychic powers are going to be pretty damn high, but I don't know. Pretty solid. Get it? Pretty solid. Solidified. Haha, <laughs> it, it's funny. All they're going to do is fire, apparently. That's just excellent. Well, I love sitting through this animation. Oh, yes, I do. Heavy bazooka. Alright, now the rest of us can pretty much just bash this guy. We should be good. Bam! Nice job, Paula. Woohoo! See, the psych psychos aren't too bad. They just use fire all the time. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Rocko! Anyway. Let's heal up. We got... How about we use... Yeah. There we go. We'll use pretty much beta on everyone else. Except, does anyone else even really need it? We'll use it on Paul, I guess. How much HP? You only have 229, Paula? Oh my god. Poor Paula. It's so low on HP. But she can't be touched in this area. I mean, seriously. There's nothing anyone can really do to her. Another Psychic Psycho, but if it's by itself, this is honestly not going to be a hard battle at all. Just everyone bash the crap out of him. Stop getting guts attacks, Paula! I know the smash attacks, but whatever. It, it's her guts. Let's let's look at Paula's guts for just one second here. Not an equip. Status. Alright. Ness has 51. Paula has 42. Jeff has 32. Who has 18? What the fuck? What, what is going on here? I can't even begin to fathom why she has so much guts. Literally, I just don't get it. Why? Is there is there any help that's going to... I mean, she keeps smash attacking, sure. But there's a cheerup band. Like Chubby Cheeraboo. Yeah, fucking Chubby Cheeraboo. Where does that go over? Does that go over your arm? I'm assuming. Yep, here it is. Oh, damn. That's a big defensive increase. Yeah, let's give that to Ness. I mean, why not? We need him to have a little bit of defense. Why not? These guys are running away from me. Otherwise, they're just bouncing all over the place. This is just a little pathetic. What the? Soul consuming flame with boss music. Okay, freeze beta, Let's spy this thing, I suppose, because it is, it does have a boss theme, might as well, I'm assuming freeze is going to absolutely, yeah, look at that, this poor bastard isn't going to get anywhere, he didn't even last, <clears throat> why give him the boss theme, anyway, that was some pretty awesome experience, IQ up by one, that's all I care about, let's roll, nope, dodge, Please don't be any fire. Okay, good. I mean, there's lava fire, but not actual fire. Hmm. Where do I want to... Seriously. These guys have to stop back attacking me. Okay, soul consuming flame. What are you going to do? Oh. My. Fuck. That was... Fire Omega, I'm pretty certain. Well... That's why it's the boss theme, apparently. Uh, no, I don't want to use PSILP. I want to actually, uh, heal myself up. Then I want Paula to use Freeze Omega. Sh Jeff, you're going to shoot. Actually, yeah, yeah, let let's use sh the Heavy Bazooka. And Pooh, you're also going to heal yourself with Life of Beta. Alright, everyone. Uh, places. Freeze Omega! Poor bastard. One shot, like a bitch. Woohoo! Paul's now level 63. Jesus. Is that higher level than Ness? There's no way that is. Yeah, Ness is level 68. All levels are pretty close. I mean, Pooh's definitely the lowest level, but not by much anymore. He used to be really low level, but now he's, like, really starting to get up there. So that's good. Good to hear. God fucking damn it. No, not again. <laughs> Okay, well, if he's just going to edge closer, I'm going to bash him closer. That's that's all that's going to happen. Gamma, shoot. Gamma. Why not waste all of our PP on these stupid things? Am I right? Freeze a gamma. Man, we are really starting to break this thing down really hard. 
Holy crap. That is a lot of experience, too, so I'll take that. Um. Dodge the fire. Fuck! That couldn't have been a back attack. Paul was there. Another soul consuming fire. Shit. Oh, that was just a singular attack. Okay. I'll take that. I mean, if you're just going to hit Ness, that's perfectly fine by me. I'm pretty sure two freeze betas will be able to take him out. I'm pretty sure that's why I tried the first time I fought these guys. Anyway, yep, look at that. And if he solidifies, that's the... <laughs> okay, well, way to show off to Paula, then. I mean, Paula's been doing it this entire time, but hey. Pretty impressive, Ness. Was that a back attack? Yes. Please be an instant... I'm overleveled. That's all there is to it. Who's now level 57? That was a shitty level up. I'm going to use life up beta on myself because I forgot to do that last battle. Level 555 HP. Holy crap. Another back? Nope. No back attack. It's honestly hard to back attack a fire where there really is no back to the monster. I mean, come on, guys. Bash. Paula, we're going to use freeze. Actually, you know what? Let's do this a little bit better. How are we going to pull this off? I still have Flash Omega. How much does that cost? 32. That is a pretty sizable cost. Um, alright. Well, we're going to use LP Beta, I suppose. Paul, you're going to freeze Gamma him. Jeff, you're going to shoot him. And Pooh, you're going to freeze Gamma this guy. This is a total waste, but I don't care. I just want to get through these annoying things. Boom. I wonder what Rockin' looks like. I, I know how the comic showed it, once again, referencing the comic. But, seriously, how does it look? Does Ness literally just pull out a guitar and start strumming? That'd be damn awesome. Because in the show, uh, in the pop comic, goddammit, they literally show it out to be, like, a legitimate spell. Which is just such a funny name, Rockin'. Like, you never even see Ness Rockin'. He doesn't have a guitar or anything. He doesn't have, like, a bass. No, that that's safe for Duster. I don't know. Whatever. Lift up Alpha on myself. And Pooh, you're looking like you're pretty low on PP, so don't worry. You got some water for you. Does this only work for Pooh? Very expensive water, but almost the same as the water you drink in town. Yep. Here you go, Poo Poo. There you go. I wonder if that'll work on Paula. I don't know, honestly. This is probably a waste, but I'm going to use it on Paula. No, it's it's definitely just for Pooh. But she enjoyed it, I'm assuming, because of all the fire here. Um, let's fight this guy. He's just blocking the present. Why don't he? Makes sense. The evil elemental. I'm assuming this is something I don't want to fight, but... Let's try to use light attacks first. Uh, I'm just worried about his shield, so shield kill it, and Pooh... Uh, freeze Alpha. Any shield? No, it's just completely resilient to freeze, though. I should have assumed that, considering it's a ghost. Oh, great. Shield killer. Okay, he doesn't have a shield. Everyone bash. Bash and cash. Thanks. Thanks, tiny little ghost. Honestly, a tiny little ghost does nothing. It just literally screwed. Like, the only thing it does is make you freeze. It's honestly one of the weirdest status elements, but it really just doesn't do anything. Anyway, healing Gamma isn't going to work, is it? No, nope, we need healing Omega. That's all there is to it. Here you go, Pooh. Oh. Really? There's no way to get rid of that ghost. Huh. Okay, maybe that's a bit more of an annoying status ailment than I originally conceived. There's a bag of Dragonite inside. Hmm. Yeah, there's... Let's try the Brainstone. Who used the Brainstone? But nothing happened. Okay. Um... I got nothing. Yeah. Yeah, it looks like you're just gonna have to deal with it, Pooh. I mean, sorry, man. You got a little ghost following you. Enjoy Casper, I suppose. It was kind of an okay movie. Not really. It was actually pretty shitty. But anyway, how on earth do I get over there now? I probably just went down the incorrect way. Let's go back through here. God damn it. Skip. 
All right, sorry about that, I'm back. I took the liberty of walking down here because I believe there is a path down here that I completely missed. Anyway, uh, there were a couple level ups that were gained. I believe Ness got to level 69. I'll make jokes now. Paula got to level 64, learned PSI Fire Omega, and any other stats that were changed are changed. And the past is the past. Let's go. God damn it, how on earth do I get through this place? Oh wait, probably over there. Well, that would probably fix it. <laughs> 